This is Roulette, the reshoots. In order to do the reshooting, which is the only viable option for us at this point, we had to obviously get a new actress. A recasting was actually difficult, but not for the reasons that casting it originally were difficult. Originally, we kind of were going with who we knew we had, who was available, who we knew would work for us, people we were friends with, that sort of thing. For this one, since we've had so much buzz going on for a while with the film, people were aware of it, and so we actually had a lot of people to choose from. Jan David Souter, who plays Leon in Roulette, and who had referred us multiple actors before during the initial round of shooting, and had actually gotten us Will Haza, who's one of the stars in the film. Jan had referred us several actors, and we knew of a couple ourselves, and so we just had them come in and read. Four actresses we read for the part that Eric liked, and, um, and actually settling on one person was very hard because everybody had things we really liked. Had them do three different scenes that sort of showed the character's arc, you know, one where they were happy, one where they were upset, one where they were really, really upset, just to see what they were capable of doing. I auditioned with all the, uh, the actors and that was she was, she was, it was tough. Everybody it was, wasn't a bad read. No, there wasn't a bad read at all. We had it narrowed down at one point, but making the final decision was not something that was easy for either Eric, myself, or Laura. Scene 47B. My friend Jan called me up and he said, listen, I have this awesome friend who made this incredible movie and they had a, an actress fall out and I auditioned for it and I like waited by the phone because it just seemed like such a perfect role and so much fun to play. and." I got it. <laughs> so we went with Michelle Murad, who is, the enthusiasm she's bringing to this is exactly what we need right now. My name is Michelle Allegra Murad, and I am the new Zoe Clark. Yeah. She started telling dirty jokes like the first minute she walked in the door. Yeah. You know, which we approve of. We usually we have a break in period with new people where we try to make them feel really uncomfortable and see how they handle it, but she was making us uncomfortable, like a room of men, and she, it was just kind of She creepy. made crack the sex jokes. We wanted to, we were uh, willing to, but we it were was like, creepy. we don't know you well enough At yet. first, it, so. was, it was a little creepy, but now we're like, you know, she fits in perfectly. Very funny, great personality. So on a scale of handsomeness, of zero to 100, where would you rank Mike Baldwin? A hundred, fifty, duh, 150 out of 100, 150. Great co-star, great co-star. I'm happy that they picked her, you know. I think that she's gonna be a good addition to the roulette cast. Hands down, this movie's gonna be better. It just keeps getting better. I mean, it was awesome many ways to begin with, but now it's like, we're up in ante a little bit. We're making it that much better, you know what I mean? We're taking like an X, it's like if you had a, a chocolate cake with chocolate layers inside, and then there's chocolate frosting, and you decided to add semi-sweet chocolate chips on top, that chocolatey extra goodness, that's what I'm talking about. She's fun to work with. She's got a lot of energy. She loves the script. Um, enthusiasm is always very important. She looks great on camera, and she's been doing a really good job today. The reshoot is actually a lot more <laughs> relaxed because we already know what it needs to be, what it needs to look like, and we were very happy with what we did before. So we know what we like already. I mean, it's not like we don't have to find lights anymore. You know, we know where the lights gotta go. And also knowing, once again, how close we are to being finished. So everyone in the world, hopefully, will get a chance to enjoy what we've done is uh, another driving factor. You know, we're, we're this close again to the finish line. I mean, I treat each project as if it's, you know, whether, you know, if somebody were to get get sick and I was put in that position. I mean, um, I, I don't know, like I just haven't, I never thought of it as like a replacement. Um, I just thought of it as a, a great opportunity and experience to work with some really talented people. I liked the way Eric approached my acting and did it complete, almost completely different. I brought in a different kind of energy that he caught on and um, and he was just saying that like 
it was not, not even close to exactly the same scene, but it, it hit all the points that he wanted to hit. Cut, very, very good. Bring her um, a, a new life, a new Zoe. Here's to Mike, without whom we would not be able to do these reshoots. If he had Yay. not agreed to it, we would be in a lot of trouble. And here is to, <laughs> here is to Michelle, <laughs> who is just saving the day. We love you so much, thank you. Thanks, guys. Chaser is very necessary. Yeah, no problem, Chris. No problem. Brian's like, I chase my liquor with that. more liquor. Look at that. I'm gonna, I'm gonna put a, we're, gonna, we're gonna put a timer up right here about how no, long it takes don't. you to drink this. You'll be here all day, and I think you have a, what, train I, to catch? I, I have a bus to catch in about...